What's going on guys, Cobra here. Welcome back once again to my Season 4 Timber and Stone Let's Play. This is Day 54, that means it's Episode 54. I think I have somewhere in the range of 67... Something like that. I didn't restart the client, so I don't know exactly. 67, maybe 68. Got a couple migrants. All of them have been sent to the farm. We're trying to break the, break this food kind of stalemate we have right now. Of course, as I get a migrant, I throw him into the farm, which doesn't help because he eats, but doesn't produce well. But as they skill up, it should kind of swing the right way. Uh, as you can see, I've made a little progress on the wall since we last departed. Uh, this wall is pretty much, like I said, done. We've got a little touch up here. I had a guy trapped in the wall somehow. You know, it's, it's that timber and stone AI. It's going to happen, though. This is a pretty complicated build and stuff, so I don't, that doesn't surprise me. But i got to finish that up, pull those away, and then that wall, like I said, let's just get all these out of here. That wall, like I said, will be pretty much all done. Oh my goodness. i got to turn all stuff off. I'm just lazy. Um, that wall will be, for, for the most part, done. I mean, that's a pretty secure wall. Four Four thick at just about every spot. It gets a little thin over here, which I don't, I'm not crazy about. I'll touch it off if I get time, but I don't think that's really too necessary. Um, but yeah, I'm trying to get this wall. I'm at least going to get it to grade height and all the way across so that we have one. Uh, that'll be a pretty big feat. That'll be one continuous wall all the way around. It'll be pretty sweet. I'm excited to see that, see how it looks. Uh, again, the guys are continuing the train. Let's see where we're at. I haven't checked them since I was on camera with you guys. 14 infantry, not so hot, moving, but 17, all right, Edmund, all right, so let's see here, Edmund, you can go stand at guard patrol, so you are done, okay, so what do we got, Allison, forager, actually, maybe, you know what I'm gonna do, boom, you are gonna be Allison, you're, actually, I should make you a quick learner, but let's see, uh, you go fish, this water should work, I, I believe, I don't think you need much to be a fisherman, Let's see what she can do. See how quickly she can kind of skill up. Just again, just some way to augment our, our farming. I don't know if a fisherman's going to make a dent in it, but it seems nice to have, uh, you know, of every profession in the city anyway. So, um, that kind of works. Um, we'll see. If I, if I feel like we're not really getting anything out of this. Which actually, let's see. Let's do food barrel. Right up in here. So she doesn't have to go far. Hey, what else might she need? I don't think the fish pole is going to break. Uh, I guess a bed, but she'll just have to walk right there. I'm not going to put a bed sitting right there. A uh, bit of a stone choke point here. Uh, going to be a bit of a problem. I don't, it's amazing how quickly I go through stuff. Let's, we're going to pump up the, the speed. We're, we're, we're clearly not going to get our attack today. I'm sorry. I, you know, I'm hoping to do it as quick as possible. As soon as these people are ready, we're going to do it. It's going to be on me. It's going to be on me and my micromanaging the guys in combat and stuff. Um, I, it'll probably coincide with just about when they're done with this, so that'll work out nicely. In case, like I said, we get that big counterattack that I'm, I'm fearful of. Uh, if you don't notice, we are kind of exposed right now. We could take an attack. It would be bad news. It would be interesting if they uh, kind of noticed us sitting here, say across the way, Mr. Necromancer or something. One thing you'll notice, just for... Just for Time's sake, I'm not digging the big foundations like I was bit digging in the front. Uh, the moat, you know, not gonna have a moat on this side, so I don't have to get down to. What are you doing over here? What are you doing, pal? What, why are you in the moat? You need a bath? What? What is going on? Sniper, what are you doing, man? Stand to guard positions. Did you fall off? I don't know. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Getting a little framey. Uh, that's one way to... Uh, I thought she was standing in the water. Okay, so they're building it slowly. I don't really have the rocks for it, but I would like to kind of fill all this in. Fill in the sand. The rocks for it. The blocks, I should say. Let's see what we got set up to go here. Um, brick 2. Plaster I'm going to need. And I'm going to need regular cobble 2. Just need a ton. A ton of everything. So, they're just going to have to fabricate that for a while. I mean, there's just not really any way around that. Plaster will be used to fill in. So, we can actually fill more of this in. It's going to be the last of the plaster, probably, for now. And then over the top of that, we will do grass and fieldstone and all that kind of good stuff. That's going to start getting us up to grade, which is pretty cool. This is going to be an issue in here, but that'll get us the whole half 
we'll be up to grade. That'll be a pretty good accomplishment. We don't have much dirt, which is kind of crazy. I need to start digging this back in here. Uh, kind of coal cleaner it out like I did on the other side, but it's not really something I want to do. It's, it's super labor intensive and stuff, so we will see how that goes. at that level just yet fill in that little trench that'll be good as they build everything else yeah I guess overnight I'm gonna have them goblin more oh here we go where is he he's in the water that's interesting that is interesting I wonder if he is do we have any others I wonder if he was trying to pathfind to this archer You, you, sir, come over here. Oh, you got him. Never mind. Yeah, that lag. That'd be floating in there. A little... Oh. Oh, there we go. Oh, they're after her. Is she taking damage? Oh, she's almost dead. Traders coming. I was any indication that she saw them or has been attacked by them and they're gonna kill my wood pile and stuff. Awesome. Or is it yeah, he's burning out my wood pile. I don't have a, I do have a guard position. Where is he? All right, he's gonna go get him. Hopefully he does. Oh, is that my patrol? Oh, yeah, yeah. Why is what that was about? Did he kill himself? He did kill himself with the flames. <laughs> uh, that's pretty funny. So I gotta go out and rebuild this again. I didn't lose any resources for that though. Where are you going? Goes down in the water. And it's going over here. I wonder if it has something to do with the guard position? Or may, I, I might have clicked there. I may have. I'm not sure. Kinda kinda silly. Let's take a look over here for you guys. Now although we've talked about it, I talked again. A lot of these guys are in the air. And I'm told this happens when, you know. He's got a crowd on him. He can he can actually spawn skeletons. He pulls them out of the ground. These aren't just like regular edge of the map spawn skeletons. So when you have a crowd around him like this and he decides to spawn a skeleton, there's only limited spots where he can do that. If he does it where there already is a skeleton, you get this problem where these guys are up in the air. So it kind of stinks. I'm going to have to take these guys out with archers. I don't think they can kill me unless I get within melee range. So they'll be easy pickings for the archers. So this, this, this army here isn't as epic as I you know we kind of thought. But, I mean, they're still... Oh, those guys are in the air. See, they're still quite... Basically, the ones that are moving around. So, there's got to be what? I don't know. T at least ten of them. Plus the Necro. But, yeah, then we'll, then we'll probably have to, you know, take that army out. And then... Why did we just... Oh, should be... Did I miss something? Oh, did we pause again, or I just forgot to unpause it? Should still be a good battle. Watch this fire. This fire's gonna rage. Watch. Fire, fire truck would take down my whole city. <laughs> uh, come on with this. You, that's why I don't like to put things outside. Because it doesn't take much to have them get killed. But, yeah. Not much I can really do. The trader already came and went. I forgot about him. No big deal. Really not much we could kind of get from a tra uh, trader. Alright, so we can build in some brick too. We've got that going. Single bump there. That'll be all that. I thought about making a gate out here. I don't think I'm gonna do it. I don't think just you know it's gonna take me more time to go out the front and walk around this way, but that's fine. 
I want to do is I do want to put. What happened over here? Yeah, that should that should be good. That'll get me up onto the wall from there. She is fishing. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. This is probably a waste of a of a person, but we're gonna we're gonna stick it stick with it there for now. Give them access out. And then, yeah, we should bang this. I mean, as long as they produce the the stone I need quick enough. But I wish I could make three different kinds at a time. You know, like one stone mason does one thing, one does the other, one does the other. But they're not letting me do that. Will these guys stand around, miners? Yeah, all right. I'll give them a job in a second. How are you guys doing? Fifteen, not bad. Where did uh? All right, is this still on fire? It is. Now what the heck happened here? Oh, there she is. Okay. Why are you not training? Thirteen archery. Not sure what's going on here. There we go. All right, just took a minute. He's in the bed. What was I gonna do? Oh yeah, give them, give the miners a job. Uh, let's see. Take all that out. Uh, yeah, I'm actually not gonna dig that out. Just gonna get as much of the dirt as I can. We may need it. We may not. I'd rather get it, feel good about it, than not get it and be pissed that I didn't do it later. That would kind of suck. We can't finish. We can't do what we wanted to do because I didn't take the time to do it. I'll leave this. This is the center of my circle that I've been using. So we're gonna leave that as it is there. Give him a lot of That's a lot of dirt for them to dig. Look like a mess when they're done, but it shouldn't take them very long to do it. I'll start filling it in with the plaster once I get that built up again. No reason to have him sitting around. Plenty to do, plenty to do. It doesn't have to be perfect. Uh, how are we doing on food? 26.68. All right, we're, we're climbing up. Got to be the fisherman, right? Yeah, right. Um, I have these guys. I think the two, the two woodchoppers are just set to go auto, which is not very efficient, actually. Those aren't all mature yet. but These guys seem to be. So what I will do... Chop. These guys ready? Seems like it. So hopefully they'll prioritize that. I just want to do that so that they grow back quicker. You know, the other ones, the kind of stragglers around, is not a big deal. Um, so there you go. Hopefully this will uncover me quite a bit of you know resources, some coal and iron and stuff. We shall see. These guys can go. I like having them there, but uh, I'll set them up again somewhere else. Laggy, laggy my strokes now, cause the frame my frames are pretty low now. You know, 60, 70, 70 people walking around in my little village here is gonna do that. 
All right, so that's a that's a ton of dirt they're gonna strip back. So let's make sure we've got plaster there. I've got brick two being built. Yeah, I'm gonna need a lot of plaster. <laughs> need a lot of brick two too. Actually, actually, I don't need a ton of brick two. So you know, what? let's let's move move that up one. Brick two could get us close. Well, what I'm actually what I like to do. Well, we could do it this way. Brick two. This this green one here is always going to be the the brick. This is where the outer edge is going to be. So we've got one, two. This is going to be brick as well. I'm trying to do an outline of the wall here so I can get rid of the dirt. I can look. I, I probably should have looked at it first. Uh, you know what? I don't really like that. So we're gonna get rid of that. We're probably gonna have. Yeah, probably gonna make this. Yeah, we're gonna make this come in direct. Straight line, but that's okay. I don't have too many of them. And then from putting those blocks in, I can kind of figure out how everything else goes. So I know my spacing. It's, it's four wide. You know, that'll get me to where I need. That'll give me enough so I can have them start working on this, digging this stuff out. A little bit of a risk because we could get attacked. We could get something through the water, but you know, I, I don't want you out here. Oh, God, one archer. See, we, we are getting stuff out here. So let's see what we've got here. Pretty beastly. Can't mess with a guy fully tanked up. We do seem to be getting a little, not a lot more, you know, action, but we, we're definitely getting run-ins here. Right, so the fire is finally out. My witch hopper should be inside at this point. I don't know why you need to be out there. You can't just sit in here. They've got a lot of work to do over there. Give me, all right, I do have somebody working on the wall. That's good. They'll chop that up pretty quick. While it seems like this, the smaller, the, like the, the brick two takes the longest to, to make create the craft and wood is getting full all right because we've got almost 700 wood that's pretty good that'll help me on the bridge food still same thing kind of at a stand still there frustrating so i'm gonna have them make a bunch of what are you doing here man really <laughs> i just don't think i can really have them make right now I mean, I've got, yeah, I guess a new brick, too. And then we'll be finishing up the episode here. So this guy went one more. One more. And then I went... I can't until they destroy it, obviously. Uh, but yeah, I said that this is going to be straight in. So that's one, two. Right? The red is one. That's two. That's three. So that's going to go there. straight wall right to there that's gonna, is that that's not right that is all right so this goes all the way into that one yeah I mean one more. all right we'll figure it out once they clip it out it's a little confusing for me right now I want to get this out of here. I want some sand in there. Same thing over here. I want it to look right. I want it to look right. Did they finish this over here? Yes, they did. So I can get rid of that. This is this little staircase is a mess, but it works. It's functional. This is the better way to have it. But we'll, we'll patch all that up when we get to it. Oh my 
I got this here I can do. I realized I hadn't finished that. Go finish that up. There we go. We're, we got a couple miners somewhere. Where are you at? That's whatever. It's all. Well, it isn't all work. I was going to say it's all the same. Why do I have the circle thing? I hope the game isn't going to. Me. All right, I just had a little glitchy thing going on, so I just I stopped the recording quick so that to make sure that it didn't get corrupted. I've had that issue lately with Prison Architect. I think I had it once or twice here, didn't I? Um, so I don't know. I've had weird things going on. I don't know if I might have a hard drive issue somewhere. I don't think I do, but I used to never get errors, and now I do. But I I, I mean, obviously, I'm taxing this game quite a bit now. Like I said, I've got to have almost 70 you know inhabitants in here. So there you go, you can see we're going to start stripping this back because we need the dirt. It's only a thousand. And once I make as much brick too as I need, we're going to we're gonna kind of chew through that very quickly. We're going to come back in with the plaster to raise it up because you get two plaster per dirt, which is good, you know, good value. Going to have these guys take the trees. That should get us up to about a thousand wood. These guys are training up as fast as I can. Uh, once they're ready, I'm hoping in the next couple episodes, we'll be going across the river and we'll attack them finally. And then for there, it's going to kind of stir the hornet's nest. Who knows what's going to come after that. But I hope you'll be here watching. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll talk to you next time. Take care.